So the other day I put out uh, two videos actually uh, of me riding my motorcycle into town and one was a review, no one was a setup video and one was uh, kind of a rant video and uh, I talked about or yeah I talked about that I would do a, like a tutorial video on how I kind of fix the audio so this is kind of it. In that video uh, the audio that I recorded had a massive amount of static and peaking. Now this could be, I was doing a motor vlog, so I'm still trying to figure out how to get the audio to work properly. Uh, but, uh, this could be something that, you know, you're recording off of your traditional mic, you're running through a, an audio board, a sound mixer, uh, and you are, uh, not wearing headphones or anything like that because I, I don't I don't want to wear headphones while I'm recording this for you and uh, you listen to it after and you've done your whole spiel and you're like oh there was peaking oh there was static etc etc and you're like now I got to redo all that but maybe you don't and and this is this is a kind of a cool tool and it's a tool that you do need a, an Adobe account for now I don't think you need a paid Adobe account as of now but you do need an Adobe account, so if you don't have one, you're going to have to get one and sign up. Anyways, just so you guys can see the audio first. So this is this is a, this is a 360 clip. It doesn't matter what kind of clip it is, but this is a 360 video clip. Now, this part, you don't really have to do if it's just an audio clip, but I need to get the audio from it. So if I open this and bring the screen over here so you guys can see it right here. Um, what you'll do or what you'll see here is I'll, I'll come into, I don't know, we'll, we'll come into like the four minute mark. I don't know where there's actually me talking, but if you listen to this, ready? And uh, my face, my face is, is just hot all the time. Uh, I, I, I can't see myself wanting that. I really don't. So I actually, like I said, I reached out to Insta360 as well. And uh, anyways, you, you, you can hear that. Fair bit of static, yes? So I'm on a Mac, but again, however you have to get just the audio, because this program won't let you, not that I know of right now, uh, upload a video clip and just pull the audio. It has to be an audio clip that goes up. So in QuickTime, at least on the Mac, possibly in Windows as well, uh, I'm just gonna say export this and do an audio only. So I can click here, uh, put it wherever I want, name it whatever I want, and we'll get an audio clip. So. I've done that already. I've got an audio clip out there. So what I'm going to do is minimize this. And all you have to do at this point in time is you're going to go to Chrome, which is uh, here. And uh, you'll actually see, see, this is a Adobe podcast beta. Now, this is why I'm saying it's free as of now. Will it be free forever? I don't know. Uh, I hope so. Um, and it says you can choose a file. So I have a file here. Let's see if I can find it. This is my test audio. I'm just gonna drag it here. Test audio.m4a, which is what we created. I'm gonna just drag it on there. And I've actually done this one before, but you'll see it upload. And again, all this stuff depends on how fast your internet and how big a file it is. Now this is a 28 minute file. So this is gonna take some time, which is why we won't just put it here. But the last time I did this file probably took and I'm pretty sure it does it all server based. Uh, I'm pretty sure it took, and you'll see it's enhancing speech right now. Um, probably, probably a good five minutes. That's, but that's 28 minutes of audio. Yes, 28 minutes audio. Anyways, once that happens, you'll just see that there's an enhanced speech. That's really the only thing as of now that this does. Uh, by default, it sets itself at 90. I didn't find 90 for mine because the static was way up there like that's aggressive static probably the worst static that you could possibly get so i just cranked it up to 100. now what we'll do is we'll play that exact same section so i'm gonna i'm gonna stop this because really after it's done after this enhancing finishes uh you can just hit download and it'll download a wave version of it so that you guys can match it up with your footage or maybe you're just uploading an actual podcast so you just need the audio anyways uh, here, here is that audio. So take a listen. And, uh, my face, my face is, is just hot all the time. I, I, I can't see myself one that I really don't. So I actually, like I said, I reached out to Insta360 as well. So really the first thing is, is that 
it's not perfect. And if you wanted to go in and do some more tinkering, you probably could in your in your audio editor. But it makes the audio usable. At least for the majority of us, right? And again, this was aggressive. This was really, really, really audio that normally should have just went right in the trash. But, you know, if you could cover it up with some background sound, like for me, if I wanted to add an actual like motorcycle engine sound in there, or if you wanted to put some music in there, um, I think on YouTube, that would be that would be fine. There'd be no issues. You guys, again, if you want to watch the full videos that I actually use this for, um, there they just came out just before this one, like a day or two ago, and uh, you can watch those in their entirety and get an idea of... Uh, Oh yeah, no, that's 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 better. It was it was better enough that I could, I uploaded those videos. All right, guys, uh, cool little thing from Adobe. It's only going to get better, right? It's only going to get better. It's in beta right now, so um, it's it's taking audio files to to learn, I guess. All right, guys, uh, I'll put links down below. Uh, make sure you do have an Adobe account for this, and uh, we'll see you guys next video. Later. All right, guys, uh, that's it for this video. Um, I'm having fun with these scammers. You know what? Uh, you know, it, the camera, the helmet, all of it. It's kind of, it's kind of nice being able to play around with them and, for one, uh, do these videos, which gets me out on the bike, which is fantastic. Number two is that uh, finding out issues, which is always good, which is uh, what I hope some of these companies that actually send me some of these uh, pieces of hardware are, are wanting me to do.